Is it bad that I found it so funny? Yes, you're a terrible person. Well, at least Damo nearly dying will help people forget what we did. Well, we made a serious costume to highlight the very important issue of acid rain. Mm, we made crappy hats. Yeah, we really did. <laughs> You've still got stuff in your... Thank you. Not for deep in you. For tonight, I need a little off. Chris. Mm, and Frank. And... Oh, this is nothing you need to hear about. I'm happy to listen. We're not like that anymore. Well, we're not friends. Well, is that all that's going on here? It would be so easy. It would. But would it be right? I'm gonna head home. Don't wanna wait for our medal? Oh, we'd be lucky to get a certificate of participation. No. No. You're not scared? I'm excited. Oh, Finn. I knew I always knew. It's you. You're the stalker. Your sexy eyes. No. Admit it. You stalked me, terrorized my girlfriend. No. You've been in my home? What was that like, huh? Watch me sleep? Did it turn you on? Did it? I'm out of here. Did Say I... it, you sick freak. Say your sexy eyes. Okay, this is crazy. You've got it all wrong. Oh. Now back off. Or else. Well, well, well. If it isn't the Joker. They found all my stuff in an empty supply cupboard. The boys are putting it all back now. Any comment on that? Depends. Need some energy. I'm sorry. That mentally you're still in high school playing little games because a girl you like is interested in someone else. You need to deal with that. Maybe before you get fired. Well, thanks for confirming you're a tool. I wasn't completely sure. The thing is, mate, you don't have a chance. The admin girl had quite a few things to say about you. You're an orderly with a criminal record. I'm a qualified surgeon about to become a consultant. No woman in her right mind is going to walk past me to get to you. Life doesn't stop you from being a tool. There's winners and losers, mate. Deal with it. It's all. But hey, one door shuts, another opens. Since you enjoy strutting around like that, you should head on up to Q Road. Moonlight at the strip clubs. Maybe one day you can shimmy your way into my tax bracket. So what happened with you and Esther? Curtis was there. Mm. He was being a jerk. I was pouring my heart out to Esther, but nothing I said seemed to matter. And I lost it. And lost her. I don't know. There's still a chance after the dust settles. Can you give up? I know I have. Want to go fishing? <laughs> <laughs>